Hi, this is Eric Martin with Board Game Geek. I'm here with Patrick Havert from Quick Simple Fun Games looking at Robert Burke's Moons. Correct. It's a trick-taking game with a twist. Now, there are four different suits. Each one is a planet, and the moons from that planet are represented by the cards. Okay. Each one has a little science fact on it that tells you a little bit about that moon. The cards range from 1 to 14. In addition, there's four asteroid cards in the game. Okay. Now, everybody starts with two asteroid cards. They let you either cheat or get bonus victory points at the end of the game. So you can trade, force people to trade you different tokens or different cards for your benefit. Now, one of the twists is, is that after you get your hand, you set out three cards, and that's your tableau. Those okay. are the only cards that you could actually get tokens for if you win a trick. So you won't be able to get all four in a turn unless you get very lucky. Because the only other way to get tokens is whoever has the most tricks will be able to get one of anything they want. Right. If you play the lowest off suit, you'd actually be able to get a token of that suit. So in this case, if those three had been played, and let's say nine was the lead, the lowest would be three off suit, so I would be able to get that moon from, okay. from, from the pool here. Correct. All right, so you set out this as sort of a bank or you know, your holdings initially, and the goal is to collect tokens? Correct. Rather than anything else? The tokens are what you're going to score at the end of the game. Okay. Now there's a little scoring sheet here. If you get a complete set of the four, it's worth 10 points. If you get three of a kind, they're worth six. Any moon is worth one. Okay. Now, the bonus cards will sometimes let you alter that by getting more points for different collections of certain types of moon tokens. Okay. Uh, does the standard trick-taking rules apply? Yeah. Something that's led has to be followed? Correct. Is All there of that's trump? the same. There, there's no trump. No you trump. can play an asteroid card to slough off even if you have a color of that okay. to try to manipulate the position and hopefully get better card play. Okay. All right, um, but it's all about collecting these tokens in the long run. And basically you play, everybody deals once and the game is over. Usually if you play with more than four people, you'll run out of tokens and that's also an end game mechanic. Okay. You also have to watch the number of tokens available because if something runs out, there aren't any more. Okay, all right, there you go. A quick run through of Moons by Robert Burke, published by Simple Fun. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you.